Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to the shed. I'm Lonnie. Good morning, Candace. Good morning. Candace is back. She's working on box knives and some other stuff there. <laughs> morning, Pip. Pip Dog. Pip Dog is being lazy as usual. Uh, we've got a bunch of stuff out in the middle. Well, I'll put it here. I think, I think the bottom was empty. I think this has a couple things in it. This has stuff in it. This is empty. I've got my fake Jordan autograph here. Most people think this Jordan autograph is fake. Is it? I have no idea. I would lean towards fake. I haven't really looked at it much. They have a service though that I found. Beckett has it and somebody else has it too where you can like link to a, an eBay listing and they'll look at it and tell you they'll give their opinion on whether it looks legit or not so yeah, no, but you don't want to list it till you know so how does that work i don't know maybe there's some way i could just send them a, a photo of it instead mm -hmm. yeah so we'll see i might do that i, I don't know it might be ten dollars wasted it's not worth that much anyway but uh let's see what else we got up here see this one's empty this bin is completely empty so need to get some of these bins out of here so we can have a little room to work yeah. uh, over the weekend i took most of the weekend off except for pulling a few orders and making a few videos um 13 listings zero and zero so that's the most time i've taken off lately um we're at 554 out of 620 goal so we've got one two three four five six seven days to get uh what 66 66 listings so we need to do a, about nine listings a day <laughs> which we're gonna do more than that oh yeah we're gonna do way more yeah. than that because we need to get i would say we're gonna list at least 20 a day i would think but uh yeah things are going good got a bunch of box sizes going out and uh, got a bunch of orders to pull and a bunch of stuff to list. So life is good. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm gonna get to uh, pulling orders, Candace. Okay. Okay, first thing pulling is a broom. Wizard of Oz, Wicked Witch of the West, broom for Charlie. Wait, it have, probably has a letter because there's a couple of them, I think. A, for Charlie, part A. Oh, it's in this thing. It's the first, I think this is the first thing I've pulled out of this little parts box. Funny thing is, I think later on, I'm actually shipping the other broom too. This sold for, uh, that sold for $6.99 plus shipping. Jen bought 1990 Upper Deck Baseball High Series. And she said, love the addition of Candace. Well, thank you very much, Jen, for the order. And thanks for watching. And Candace, thanks for, thanks for the addition. Oh, Candace has her earbuds in. Never mind. We'll let her jam out and do her box box resizers. But thank you very much, Jen. Trying to get moving this morning. All right. Sold. A box of Series 3 Stadium Club from 10 Charlie. Series 3, 10 Charlie, right here. For, I think, $24.99. Free ship. Which I'm actually making a little less money on these today because the uh, the prices just went up. I think padded flat rates are costing $7.76 now instead of $7.52. So, hopefully the... Uh, Hopefully the mail service will will be better because of that, right? <laughs> uh, sold Ticket to Ride board game from 7Charlie for $24.99 plus shipping on top. This game right here. Sold another box of the High Series. For $24.99. I wonder if these are all going to be gone by the end of this video. Cards have just been flying 
off the shelves. My mail carrier is going to have a bunch of heavy stuff today. Oh, um, Chris. Chris said, Lonnie Candace, love the channel. Thanks for sharing so much information with us, with us all. Great work. Thank you very much, Chris. Chris also bought a box of the high series stuff here. So appreciate the order and appreciate you watching, Chris. Thank you. But Angela bought two things. Angela bought series three and a box of the high series. She left a little message too. Okay, series three and a box of high series for Angela as well. My mail carrier is going to freak out. She's going to have like 200 pounds of orders. <laughs> How about if we just go ahead and load them on the dolly for Yeah, I'm, I'll put them on the little cart. But, uh, yeah, Angela said, thanks for the entertaining content. We appreciate you and Candace. Can't wait for our goodies. We sell on eBay also. Circa Diva Vintage, thank you, Angela and James. Thank you, Angela and James, for watching. And hope y'all like y'all's cards. I got a pack because I filled the uh, bench up already. Okay, got all that stuff packed. And then I uh, also pulled a bunch of makeup orders and stuff, too which I don't show you all that. Um, Anthony bought High Series and Series 3. That seems to be a popular order there. Series 3 and a box of High Series. Thank you very much, Anthony. Hope you get some good cards in here, some good rookies or whatever you're after. And Dave bought, he bought a box of High Series too. And yeah, I think, you know, I think all these baseball cards are gone today. I think I might have some other non-sports stuff that's going to be left. But uh, yeah, thank you very much, Dave. Appreciate that. Sold another box of Series 3. Oh, that's the last box of Topps Series 3. Kyle bought a box of WWE Wrestling. 10B Heritage and this is a cool box because it's guaranteed one autograph in here so hopefully it's a good one for you Kyle hope that works out sold another box of high series you know these are disappearing all right and then I think I'm gonna pull one more thing and also sold this lunch box. It's a Michael Jordan lunch box that also has 30 cards in it. It's sealed. Okay, Daniel bought three things. He bought this Jordan 23 Nights, the Jordan Experience. I think it's got like big cards and then also like a DVD in there. And then he also bought, he bought a 23 card retirement set that's in the cube. Here we go. I know you got something else. This thing. And then Daniel also bought Hasbro Transformers Voyager Animated Universe Bulkhead Loose Action Figure 8 Charlie. Bulkhead. I guess that's one of your listings, huh? Yeah. 8 Charlie. Oh, looks like this. Yeah. Okay. Boy, that fool the the listing fooled me because it didn't look like a Transformers. Boy, they got me. They decide they deceived me. <laughs> Thank you very much, Daniel. Appreciate the business. Hope you like your stuff there, man. Um, one. Oh, a minute ago I showed pulling one of these green boxes. I think it was green. It was actually two. So if y'all. Say, hey, Lonnie, you should have pulled two. You're right, I should have, and I did. Um, 1990 Fleer Jumbo Cello. One of these. This will. This is probably, unless it's going somewhere close, that's probably going medium flat rate. It's a big, big box. Oh, Jason bought a Upper Deck Baseball High Series. And he said, love the inventory. Give P-Dog a biscuit for me. So, P-Dog, Jason wants you to have a biscuit. 
Okay, you get a biscuit, P. You want a biscuit? Come get your biscuit. <whistles> anyway, here's your high series, Jason. Thank you very much. Always appreciate the business, man. And then, let's see, I'll pull one more. I can fit it up here. And then I'm going to have to bag some of this stuff and get it out. It's not really a biscuit. Uh, let's see. Okay, one more high series. What is it? Oh. Piece of dried. <laughs> it's a little. Freeze dried liver. <laughs> That's good. Here you go, Pete. You want that? Yeah. Viewer got you that, bud. Say thank you, Jason. That's a weird little cube of freeze dry, huh? <laughs> then I'm going to pull one more high series. Yep, one more high series. I'll pack these and we'll come back and get some more. There is a lot more. Well, another high series right here. Oh, I've only got one left. I hope I only have one left to pull. That one sold. Then, oh, sold a 1994 Pinnacle. Candace keeps trying to bump into me and get in my way. I'm trying to work here. This right here. Huh? What'd you say? So I'm trying to work here. Ow. I just got spanked. <laughs> oh boy. Um, and then sold RLC. Oh, sold, I think the last Dorothy in the box. Dot in the box. Sold right here for $33.24 plus shipping on top. This is for Ian. Thanks, Lonnie and Candace. Love your videos. Keep up the good work. Ian, you bought the last box of High Series. What? <laughs> what are you laughing at? What's so funny? Uh, last box of, we'll call it High Society. <laughs> High Series right here. So thank you very much, Ian. And let's see what else. Got one little, one more little slot. I still haven't brought this stuff out yet. Uh, I sold a Harley. Uh, what, what is it? A Black Canary DC pumps. What you doing? <laughs> Black Canary right here. Sold for the price on the screen. And now I'll go ahead and pack all this stuff up i think i've got about 20 things left all right still packing candace is listing i think she's done one two six seven listings so far which is good because i'm probably not going to get any listings done today but she will um sold actually i sold two photos the first one I'm going to pull right now I'll leave the other one here because I know I'm going to pull it in a minute the first one I'm going to pull though is this Hakeem Nix Giants receiver 16 by 20 autographed uh, photo really nice It's it's got the little Steiner uh, hologram here authenticating it I don't know if I huh oh, it is it raining yep. yeah I mean it's been nasty weather yeah, well, yeah. I don't know. 2189 plus shipping on top oh this is going um, to New Jersey to Hal and Dorothy and they watch daily I'm buying this for my nephew Mason a big Giants fan hated Candace and Pip, so thank y'all very much. They said hello back. Pip and hello. Pip and said hello. <laughs> Pip and you are shifty eyes. so <laughs> lazy. <laughs> but yeah, thank you, thank you, Hal and Dorothy. Appreciate it. Get this packed up for you, and this will ship flat. I'm gonna use a couple of a um, couple of the big uh, number seven boxes for that, which I'm running low on. I've got two. I've currently got two uh or three orders of these in with usps i think i have should have about 200 of these things on the way and they are taking forever they have not been good about getting supplies out i've been fighting supplies for like the past few months though with paid and free
pull some more baseball cards. Sold a Topps rack pack from 10D and a Fleer rack pack from 10C. Topps from 10D, Fleer from 10C. These are going out to These are going out to Michael. Um, appreciate it, Michael. Thank you very much for the order and thanks for watching. Hope you like the cards. Another Rack Pack 1990 Fleer from 10C. Single order here. I think I'm about to clear out. Heck, this might be the end of the baseball cards. We're right there at it. Um, not, tops from 10B and then tops from 10D on the next order. Tops from 10D and tops from 10B on one order. And these might have to go up. So it just depends on just depends on where in the country they're going. Craig in the UK bought Mr. Freeze from 8 Bravo. Would you grab Mr. Freeze for Craig Canis from 8 Bravo? Huh? Must not be on. That's not the shelf he's on. It must be down here somewhere. This is him, huh? Yeah. That's Mr. Freeze. Okay. Can't. can't it's hard to find good help, y'all. That's why I don't work in the shipping department. <laughs> shipping department. Sorry, sir. I'm gonna have to transfer you to the shipping department. <laughs> oh, they're not in. <sighs> Just checking to see if mail lady's here yet. Letter carrier. Uh, next up. Oh, thank you very much, Craig. And yes, we will definitely send that to the UK. Uh, next item is, uh, let's see, 1974 Migo Tin Man. Somebody bought just the chest armor, Candace. I was kind of wondering if anybody was going to buy this stuff, and they are. I didn't know if they were going to buy that, though. He did ask me to... I remind all sellers to package, wrap items protectively to avoid unnecessary damages during shipment. Thank you in... Thanking you in advance. Well, you're welcome. But... No, that's cool. I don't mind him saying that. This is, I guess, you know, it's he probably has to say that because some sellers probably would put that thing in a friggin' bubble mailer. Yeah. They would. I know, I know they would because I've gotten stuff like that before. Or in a cardboard envelope. Yeah, it's, yeah, I'll, it'll, that's easy to protect though. It's super light. Um, I sold a hat. Seven and three quarter ACU hat. With the hats? Yeah. If we need, well, we're gonna end up getting more gloves though. I know that. I probably will be a little more selective though, honestly. Here we go. Seven and three quarter. My size. Sold this for five, $5.49 plus shipping on top. This is a fancy sale here. Sold the Emperor's Royal Guard for $71.09. Man, you know, Candace, that sealed in baggy. You know what's funny? I think we kind of had... I, I think we we're... Well, I was expecting about seventy two dollars for this isn't really? that what the last one sold for i don't know i think it was so this this is like right on the comp almost so yeah sold this guy at auction for 71. uh sold incredible shrinking woman i may have to dig around it's on the set it's on the bookshelf oh well oh no 
know where the heck they're at. It said bookshelf, which is supposed to be here, but def. It's those uh, lobby cards. Remember those? Must be back here somewhere or something. I don't know. Oh, they're up here. Yeah, here we go. Incredible Shrinking Woman. Those sold for $14.99 plus shipping on top. So these were not fast movers at all. But that's okay. They don't take up much room. All right, I'm going to get these packed. All right, I went to UPS store. Candace has been listing. I threw a few up, but this is mostly Candace. Four, five, six, seven, ten, twelve, sixteen, eighteen so far today. And it's still pretty early. That ain't bad for a Monday. And Candace had she had a pretty good mini box resizers going out. Yeah, uh, like thirty what seven? Uh, thirty one. Thirty one. Well no. You know what? It was thirty five. Because we had thirty one singles and two doubles. So total of 35 so anyways we're we're doing pretty good today um, i got the mail uh carrier hasn't come yet i've got everything i had to get out but i now i have time i can pull some more and get them out i did get all of this inventory out of the truck and i think our goal this week by the end of this week i want to have all this stuff listed and on shelves and have this stuff cleared out of the way because this makes it very hard to move in here this this is not good <laughs> so that's our goal for the for this week candace is to eliminate all this stuff and to start working from our unlisted shelf again that didn't last long did it uh okay sold keep on pulling then sold these shoes right here got a best offer on them some Clarks uh, for, they're in nice condition, for $9.49 plus shipping on top. I know, they've been sitting there so long, I almost pulled them from Mo. Yeah, I mean. They're her size. They're, oh, are they? Yeah. Well, dang, you should have. Yeah, I don't know. I didn't know if she'd like them, so. Probably not. She's into her slip-on vans, so. Yeah, she probably wouldn't have liked those. But then, yeah. They're cool, I like them. Those have been listed a long time. I know, that's why I almost pulled them. <laughs> All right, next up is an order for Hamza, who sells on eBay at the Real Bat Store, which that makes sense because they bought a Batman from me. Nightsend Batman action figure on 8 Bravo. Eight Bravo. I guess it's this guy. Look at all these Power Rangers. I, Candace, I think these Power Rangers are sold already. I think they're all sold. Wait. What? I'm just making sure this is the right one. I don't know if it is or not. I don't think it is. Well, okay, well, I think it is. Oh, actually. no, wait. I just listed another one on card that was Night's End. That's what I thought it oh, was. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is the right guy. Yep. Does this work? Is there a disc in there? Yeah, the red thing is the thing that comes out. So does it fly out of there? Like shoot? Like pew? I don't remember. Okay. What is all, right. that? Oh, man, I don't know. Pro it, all you said approximately 4.75 inches tall please see photos for condition that's very that's like our standard listing <laughs> description i mean i'm assuming i'm trying to remember what it does well it does something there's like a switch back here yeah here take it out let's see i'm gonna probably break it you know how i am okay well please don't see you already just kicked the heater What happens when you actuate that little red thing on the back? Does it fly out of there? The red thing is the thing, I think. Oh, no, it shot out. That's what I thought would happen. <laughs> it's a little disc. Oh, gosh. That's kind of cool. That's really cool. You didn't charge enough money. I Here, did, shoot me. I should have did a video show. Shoot, shoot, shoot us. Huh? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Got me. That's kind of fun. That would have been a good video listing. That's actually a really fun little toy. Yeah, and he's cool looking. Yeah, okay. Well, anyway, 
Thank you, Hamza. Appreciate it. Sold another broom. I just told Candace this is fun. She said sometimes. <laughs> Sold another broom. This one right here. Never thought these little parts would sell like that. I guess it wasn't. I guess it was worth listing then. Uh, Six ninety nine plus shipping on top. Huh? PSOT. What? PSOT. Oh yeah, right. Um, that's all I'm gonna pull for right now. The next one is big. Hey, Anthony bought some cards too, and normally I'd be like, oh no, I should have. I wish I would have waited. But in this case, I'm. I'm don't. I don't think that matters because I wasn't going to be able to um, combine shipping on this. <laughs> I couldn't have mailed this with cards. It wouldn't have worked out very well. This is the Joe Torre and Mariano Rivera um, signed photo, 16 by 20 photo with the Steiner. It's got like MLB and Steiner certs holograms down there. And then I went and printed I looked up the MLB cert and printed it out. Uh, that's something that I printed right there. So this is going out to Anthony. Uh, they sent they they asked me if I would take 200. It was on sale for like 218. They asked me if I would take 200, and I thought that was more than fair. So I've had this thing for a pretty good while now. Uh, it's a really cool piece, and. Uh, I hope you I hope you enjoy it and uh, thanks a bunch for the business. I appreciate it. The thing is packed. I wanted to show y'all how I packed this. I took two of my own boxes in the middle there. Two full boxes. It's these these big boxes here, and sandwiched the photo in between that. And then it was already in that big top loader thing. And then I took two priority number seven boxes and sandwich that in there then tape the heck out of it and now super strong so and it's not going far it's only going to missouri which isn't that far from us so it was eight dollars and 94 cents for a four pound package that ain't bad so uh yeah we got that protected candace is over here working no it's a surprise for ryan well, this video isn't going to go up until <laughs> you want to show it after you finish. Yes. Okay. All right. That's cool. We'll come back to Candace in a minute. Okay. So, oh, good news. I got, uh, I got my number seven boxes. Some of them. I got more on the way, but I got 50 of them right here. That'll help. And I got some other stuff. Yeah. What is this? Yeah. Raid A, regional Raid A's. I wanted some of those. And I think these are shoe boxes, so yeah. Glad to see some supplies rolling in. So I pulled up a video from my buddy Ryan over at Thrift Mine, Ryan and Pam. And this is like from over a year ago, a year and a half ago, I guess. They're doing a live show where they, they draw, take a piece of paper, take something that somebody says in the audience, draw tacos. That's what Tanya over at Thrifty Treasure said. And they have to draw it on top of their head without looking at it. So, draw tacos. Um, All right, Tanya. Tanya. I don't like tacos. Currently, these tacos. Sorry for Tanya. No, this is bad. I need... <laughs> this is. Uh, all right. Okay. Do it for Tanya. Okay, I tried. I tried. Okay. Let's see your taco, Ryan. Ready? Okay. Go. Yes. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> what is that? So that was Ryan's taco from this video from August 16th, 2019 over on Thrift Mine. Well, around that same time, I also bought this from the Thif Thrift Mine channel. Uh, this is a lenticular of the uh, of Goldilocks and three bears. There's Goldilocks up there. Orange is just right. Yeah, you can't really. This doesn't do it justice. Lenticular. Yeah, lenticular. Um, and 
anyway whenever they whenever ryan packed this he also gave gave me the uh, drawing that he did of that taco or whatever you want to call that thing and i've just had it kind of stuck in the corner behind this this picture for yeah, over well over a year now and uh we've been messing around with the signs and stuff and candace uh candace saw it and she's like well, we need to do that thing justice and she decided to frame it <laughs> <laughs> so there it is in a real fancy like one of the best frames they had at dollar tree we, we bought it <laughs> yep look at that fancy mat i <laughs> know it's really nice <laughs> So there we go. It's even signed, 2019. So, and that's. We might that, be able to sell that on eBay. They're famous now. I know. They're already famous. So yep. it's already. See, a, a good investment in artwork is smart. Yes. It's already appreciated. It even has his fingerprints on it. <laughs> I don't know. That might be mine. I don't know. Were you eating a greasy hamburger? I don't know. Maybe I was eating some chicken and looking at it or something. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But uh, yeah, anyway. Thanks again, Ryan, for your whatever the heck that is. I'm pretty sure that does not. That goes with a side of sour cream. Oh, he said, yeah, he said that was a side of sour cream, and this is a taco. But, yeah. <laughs> I would say, uh, what do y'all think it looks like, but I'm not going to say that. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, Candace, how many listings you got? I think 21. 21? You're still working, though, huh? It's still kind of early. It's only 4 o'clock. Yeah. She'll probably knock out a few more. I'm gonna start editing. Um, and yeah, we'll we'll see y'all tomorrow. I think this is a good place to end this video. Yeah. So. Bye Candace. Bye. See y'all later.